OK, here's a man everybody does know real well. Noel Ferrier, welcome him in. Unbelievable. Noel Ferrier on sounds. Can't believe it. Thank, Thank you. you. Well, this is the first rock show. Yeah, that's great. Oh, look at all those. <laughs> uh, I'll start like this. Because they're no. always wanting a spunk on today. And here am I. Never mind. You can't have everything. Mate, you're this is the first rock show need. I've been on. That's great. Thank mm. you. Uh, you're the executive producer for the stage show Lennon, the musical of the legend. Mm -hmm. Now, when does that open? It's going to open in Sydney on Lennon's birthday, mm -hmm. uh, which is October the 9th uh, this year. And uh, uh, it'll be opening in Sydney. And then goes to Melbourne in January. Doing your auditions at this moment, is yeah. that correct? Yeah, we're, actually, we're auditioning at this very moment. Now, how is it too late for people who want to audition for I it? I think probably it is. They can uh, give the trust number a ring, 357-1200, and see if there's any uh, time left today. But today right. is the last day in Sydney uh -huh. to audition. But bear in mind that everyone's got to be able to do everything. Like, they've got to be able to play one or two instruments. Yeah. They've got to be able to sing. They've got to be able to act. They've got to be able to do a, a, a little putty and accent. They've got to be multi-talented. They've got to be, you know, practically a Donny Sutherland. <laughs> I do. Well, a Beatle He's anyway. Multi <laughs> how many? How many are you looking for? Is it just four Beatles, or are there other people? No, in the there's cast? nine in the cast. Nine. Seven guys and two girls, and um, of those seven boys, four of them at the various stages play the Beatles. Right. Uh, but of course, uh, two of them play John Lennon at various stages. It goes from John Lennon's. Young, very young days, yeah. uh, when he was a kid, up until the time he was, uh, he was murdered in uh, New York. And it's his whole life story, with about 40 of the Beatles numbers in it. I would find, I mean, I would think you'd find that probably the hardest thing in the world to get four people who look like the Beatles actually have that sort of talent. Ah, I mean, they're one-offs. But right? they don't have to look like them. See, that's ah. what we're, we're not going for look-alikes. What we're going for is talent, which is a novelty <laughs> uh, in itself. So they all have to be... Mainly talented. We don't care if they don't really look like right. them, you know. Obviously, if someone does look like it Paul or John yeah. or Ringo or George, fine. But if they don't, it doesn't matter. As long as they've got all of those other requisites. Have you found it difficult to find a left-handed bass player? It's not easy. Mm. I don't mind telling you. It's like casting a James Bond film when they rang through from London and said, you have to find a left-handed bass player. <laughs> and uh, so we've, we've come across three or four, but we're... We're hoping to find some more in Melbourne. But they, they are around, but they're not, shall we say, uh, easy. Because you've been in the business for a few years. Did you ever meet the Beatles? No, I went, I went into when they were first brought out here. I was uh, one of the ones in Melbourne who thought, oh, I'll just go and look at them mm. on the, the balcony of the Southern Cross Hotel. Yeah. Uh, one sun, one cold, wet Sunday afternoon. And there was about 12,000 people there. I got put through a plate, plate glass window. I went off the Beatles just at that stage. But, uh, <laughs> Did uh, you like their music? Were you yeah. a fan of theirs? Oh, yes. had Even so, them. I released a record, which uh, you, I'm sure you would have in your collection, called, uh, <laughs> yeah. called Ferrier Unfurled, on which I sang uh, All You Need Is Love. All you need is love! <laughs> With that wonderful vibrato, which has become well famous. You want to do a couple more lines? I think that's it. Yeah, a little bit. Has anyone got a copy of Noel's record? You have? Oh, someone over here. Oh, darling. Oh, oh you wonderful fantastic. person. You don't have it right with you, though. We'll get you to bring that in next Saturday morning. Oh. So, Noel, the show actually starts here, as you said, later in the year. Where else has it been? Shown and it's mainly worked. been only performed in England, so that's uh, and uh, it's been a huge success in London. Mm -hmm. uh, it's just finished there, and it's uh, played to packed houses there. So it, it opens here at the Enmore. We're going. We're opening up the Enmore as a great uh, live theatre place for this right. type of attraction, and then it goes to Melbourne to the Athenaeum, which we're where we're auditioning next week, incidentally. Okay. Well, Melbourne viewers are watching. So. Monday and Tuesday of next week at the Athenaeum. So if they just wander down to that theatre. Yeah. Can play or do this or play the drums right. uh, can act can sing yes by all means come along okay Noel Ferrier who will be executive producer for the musical Lennon the musical of the legend now, here's one of the guys that'll pop up in that show Paul McCartney with wings out of 1979 good night tonight uh, it's good night for me and it's good night for you thank you Noel Ferrier thank, thank you, you very much. Well,